There was one time I was studying my scriptures and I was studying about when the rich young ruler was asked to sell all he mm -hmm. has. And at the time, I was a stay-at-home mom, but I had a side gig where I earned some nice little income. And when I read that scripture, I had this prompting that the Lord was gonna ask me to do something with that income that I wouldn't think to do. And I was like, okay, <laughs> what does that mean? And I actually didn't know what that meant until four years later. I came across a wonderful person named Katie. We realized that we had something in common in our passion for humanitarian work in Africa. And I had been there and uh, saw the great need for education, especially for girls. And she had done the same thing and had this passion. Well, I came home after Africa and I was like, well, I, I don't know what else to do besides go on a humanitarian trip. Well, she had had this same experience and was like, I'm gonna do something about it. And she decided to single-handedly raise money to build a school in Mali, Africa. And she was like, okay, what gifts do I have that I can do this? And so she started baking these gourmet cookies and selling them. And she had a goal to earn enough money within three years. And at this point that I was talking to her, it had been two years. And so I was like, oh, so are you almost to your goal? She's, no, I'm only halfway there. And I, as I asked her how she was gonna raise the full amount, uh, she's like, well, I'm gonna become a substitute teacher and give all my money wow. so I can reach this goal. And that night I just couldn't sleep. I was just so inspired with her and just blown away that someone would give their time. Like who does that? She had four kids and who, who gives their time and gifts and money like that because they want to build a school for these children. And I woke up the next morning and I knew that was what the Lord wanted me to do with that income. And so I let her know the next morning that I would give my income for the next year until we hit that goal. Wow. God really blessed and magnified it. And we were able to hit our goal way sooner than expected and recently opened that school.